So hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Amesy's Corner. How are you all doing out there? So how many of you guys have heard the term, drive it until the wheels fall off? Yeah, until the wheels fall off. Well, you're supposed to stop driving it when the wheel falls off. Uh, this guy actually had this happen in uh, North Andover about 20 or so, 15 miles from here, and he drove it down the highway. Down, down the highway. It's got the, it's got the camber the kids like for sure, bro. It's got the camber the kids like. But uh, yeah, the, uh, the Barons went and chewed the axle up. It's actually the second time that that's happened to this truck. The right side had the same issue, but uh, replaced an axle, replaced some Barons, but this time the, uh, the fix this time is we're putting a whole new rear end in it so uh why don't i figure out a way i mean i guess if it if it drove all the way here it should should drive in the door right <laughs> A truck with the wheels falling off it drove pretty good all right let me get this up on the lift i'm going to set you guys up on a time lapse and let's see if we can get this thing back on all four wheels again <laughs> boy the stuff people drive in so uh <laughs> it went down the highway like this
All right, guys, that was a lot of work. It was a heavy little rear end for a little rear end, but uh, I think these tires were heavier. But no more play there. Nice and tight, nice and tight. Just uh, just waiting for some special gear lube, uh, 75, 140 gear lube. But uh, we don't stock it, so that's all I got to do, throw t two quarts of gear lube in it, go around the block. But, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's about all for that one. Not too, too bad, but being a lifted truck, we had to get some custom... Uh, some custom U-bolts on there to replace. We uh, we never reuse U-bolts too many times when you take them off and you go to put them on, it strips out and then you end up not able to put it together and have to order new ones anyway. So anyways, yeah, so this is a perfect example of when you should probably call a tow truck. This probably would have been a five or $600 axle repair. We could have just repaired the one side, but he had to drive here on the highway and that added, you know, $1,500. I guess, you know, $200 tow, $1,500. So if your wheels are falling off your truck, get a tow truck, please. Well, anyways, boys, it's the end of the day. Now we got about quarter of five, almost quarter of five, so that's enough of that. And until next time, keep it out of the cabbage.